Welcome back to one of these Dokkan Battlefields. It's your boy Dev, and today, yes, sir, today, today is a good day, bro. Well, I'm recording this like, you know, the night before I upload it on Friday, but today's Thanksgiving right now, but tomorrow's obviously going to be, you know, it, the time that I upload this, it's going to be Black Friday, so happy Thanksgiving, everybody. That's all I have to say. Happy Thanksgiving. Have a nice Black Friday. Have a, this, you know, be thankful for what you guys got, you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm thankful for you guys, and I'm thankful for everything I got, to be honest. I'm thankful to be doing these videos. No lie. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. Yo, yo, come on. Dev, stop getting all touchy. I, I know, I know, I know, no, no. Relax, relax, relax. I ain't getting touchy, bro. Um, but, you know, I was kind of, I kind of would. But still, um, that's not the point. The point of this video is, um... It's like a story time type video, right? So, it, it's it's not, it, it's like a story time, but at the same time, it's like you know, just me talking. But you guys, you guys get, it, you guys get it. Um, now, is this gonna be a reoccurring theme on this channel? Maybe, maybe. You know, if I if I think up some like some old stories or thoughts I had with people, um, in in relation to games, of course, then I'll talk about it. Now, you know, I'm just gonna do my dailies while I talk, so. So basically, um, this video is basically about how other people see Dokkan, right? Okay, so starting off, I had this friend named Julian. Elijah, if you're watching this video, you know exactly the Julian I'm talking about. The homie Julian. I miss him, bro. I miss him. I dearly miss him. But anyways, um, you used to always sit with my homie at lunch, my homie Julian. Um, he's cool. He's one of the coolest dudes I ever met in school. Now... Julian, right? He he like he he saw me playing Dokkan, right? He was like he's like yo Steven, yo yo what's what's that game? What's that what's that game called, bro? And I'm like uh, oh it's um Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle, um. And he's like what's it about? It's like you know, anime characters basically like you you tap these key spears uh, and then like you know just launch super attacks and like gain dragon stones and summon you know all that good stuff. What this motherfucker tells me, he's like. <laughs> He's like, oh, hey, yeah, it sounds cool. It sounds cool. All right, so let me see it. He looks at it, right? You know what he says? Oh, it looks like Bejeweled. I'm like, oh, my God. I'm like, did this mother... And he said, oh, wait, no, it, it kind of looks like Tetris, too. I'm like, how the fuck? Bro, I said, how? How does this game look like Tetris? Now I know you're tripping. Okay, so I'm like, yo, all right, I, I, I talked to him. I'm like, yo, uh, Julian, my G, you need to download the game and try it out yourself. He's like, all right, all right I'll try it, I'll try it. So, not even, like, the next day, two days later, right, you know, he, he like, he plays it. He's like, you know, I just downloaded the, the game, and, like, he opens it up in front of me. Like, he has to do a data download. I'm like, yeah, I, I mean, I forgot to tell you. I'm sorry, but there's a, um, there's a data download for the game. He's like, oh, man, oh, well, I guess... I guess I'll do it tomorrow since, you know, service. All right. Service at my school wasn't that great, especially like, you know, because we had like outdoor lunch and indoor lunch. Like you would pick where to sit, like sit outside and eat. You know, that's where I, that's where I usually sat. I sat outside with the homies. I'll be honest. Um, so that being said, outside reception was garbage. And inside, like inside the lunchroom reception was, it was, it was I, it was I, I it was I to say the least. So. He he says, all right, well, I'll come back the next day and, you know, I'll play it while I'm in school and then I'll give you my thought. And I'm like, okay, all right, bro. All right, all right, all right, all right. So the next day passes. He he comes to me. He's like, Steven, I couldn't play that fucking game. And, and I'm like, yo. I'm like, why, Julian? Bro? I'm like, okay. I'm like, all right. First thing, first thing I say is that he's, I'm like, I'm like, um, okay, so Dokkan isn't for everyone, obviously. Dokkan's not for everybody. So I'm like, okay, you know, I understand that, bro. You know, you can see why I don't like it. I met a couple of people that don't like it. My boy Julian, my boy James, you know, DSL Lips James. I, I know you. I know who you are, DSL Lips James. You know, my, my boy James, my boy Julian. I had a couple other people, you know, that didn't play it. You know, I respect I respect people who don't play Dokkan. If you don't play Dokkan, it's okay. I, I wouldn't like, I wouldn't go on a witch hunt, uh, like a type of, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that is what I'm talking about. A level 10 link in the video? 
Anyways, I wouldn't go on a witch hunt and be like, oh, that motherfucker doesn't play Dokkan. Oh my god. Wow, he's such. He's so garbage. Oh my god. No. No, son. Come on now. <laughs> the fuck? If you don't like the game, you don't like it. It's okay, bro. I'm not. I'm not gonna judge you over it. It's alright. It's alright. If you don't like Dokkan, it's okay, bro. But I will judge you if you say fucking cooler is better than Z Sword. Go on. You're fucking retarded if you think that. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, bro. <laughs> Ain't that but he sort of go on. But anyways, um. Alright, so. So, like, he comes to me. Like, let me continue the story. He comes to me. He's like, he, he basically says, like, oh, I couldn't get into the game. It's kind of, like, lame. I mean, he, he said something along the lines of the super attack animations were cool. Like, it, it was alright. But and then he said, he said exactly what I thought he would say. He, he said, um. He said, it. In terms of like the the animations, he said it's just a beam flying across the screen. I'm like, yo. <laughs> Obviously, he hasn't gotten any more units that to like uh, to do said task. And I'm like, yo. <laughs> he hasn't got any more units to, to, to see the other super attack animation. I'm like, I'm like, you know, you kind of right. For a good portion of OG Dokkan, that was basically what it was: a beam flying across the screen, or someone running at you and attacking you. So I'm like, all right, all right, Jules. I'm like, all right, all right, all right. I got you, bro. I got you. So basically with that, I'm like, um, so how come you didn't like the game? He said it was, it was boring and it reminds me of uh, fucking Bejeweled or Candy Crush. I'm like, how the fuck does Candy, bro, I'm like, Julian, there ain't no way in fucking hell this game looks like Bejeweled or Candy Crush. Don't fucking play with me. There ain't no way. There ain't no way. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. Okay, okay, okay. With the key formations, maybe? Maybe. Okay, then you can make a case. You can make a case, but it don't, don't play with me, bro. Don't play with me. There ain't no way it remotely looks like it. I mean, maybe the key. Okay, I, you got me at the key. But, like, the game itself, like, the super attack animations, they don't got that shit in Bejeweled. Get that shit out of here. But, um, I got another story for you guys. So, other than that story, this is probably my last story. I don't, I don't really... Because, like, with my experiences with other people in Dokkan, it's like, ah, those motherfuckers, bro. Those fuckers. I'm like, ah. Okay, okay. So, that was the first story. Let me tell you another story. So, I'm just, I'm chilling, right? I'm chilling. Like, uh, uh, I got my, I got my orange juice in my hand. I'm walking towards, like, like, my favorite teacher in high school's class. My boy, um, for, for the sake of this video, I'll call him, I'll just call him F. So, I'm walking towards F, F's class, right? So, this man, <laughs> all, right, all right, so I walk into class, I'm like, yo, what's up, Mr., I'll, I'll just say Mr. F, for the, for the sake of this video, um, so Mr. F, what's up, bro, what's good, I'm like, oh, Mr. F, what's, go what's going on, man, so, like, because, you know, I, you know, we greet each other, I love, I love my teacher, bro, I love, well, he was, he was my old teacher, because at, at that time, I was a senior year, I'm like, yo, it was good, bro, so, anyways, um, you know, we, we just talk and we talk about Smash because, you know, I'm, I'm a huge advocate for Smash. I still love Smash to this day. Maybe I'll do some Smash content. Hey, hey, hey. I love me some Smash. But that's besides the point. I'm going to keep it Dokkan for now. Don't worry, guys. I'm going to expand to other stuff. Just let me stay Dokkan for now, and then I'll move on. Trust me. I just want to, you know, I, I love Dokkan. This is like, I put my heart and soul into this game, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, so at, at the same time, I'm, I'm talking about Smash, right? And then out of nowhere, yo, I think it was me. Who brought up the, the topic? I think it was me. I'm like, yo. Um, someone talks to me about Dokkan, right? So I'm like, oh, yeah, 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 of course. Yo, I saw those new super attack animations. Yo, they're pretty dope. I don't remember whose super attack animations it was. I don't completely remember. It was like around the beginning of my senior year. Um, all right. And then for the sake of this video, you know, I don't want to defame nobody. Just like I called Mr. F. If you know... If you're one of my close friends, you know who Mr. F is. I'll just leave it at that. If you're one of my homies, you know. But um, while we're in Mr. F's class, E. I'm going to use E. I, you, If you my friend, you know who exactly this motherfucker is. So, E, right? E is chilling there with Mr. F, right? So, this... <laughs> this motherfucker. This big, glumpy tub of lard. This bastard. <laughs> I don't give a fuck who this offends. I'm not going to say their name. I don't give a fuck who this offends. This fucker 
as I'm talking about Doku, I'm like, yo, yeah, yeah, you know, you know, I fucks with the new Super Tag Mage. It's, it's cool, it's cool. Um, this this movie, oh, Doku on Strat's too easy. I'm like, huh? <laughs> uh, no, it's not. It's 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 not that easy. It's simple when you get it's it's like all right. It's not simple when you get the game down, cause you got motherfuckers. You got niggas like the truth, and and fucking um Goresh and silly no like no lar. They get fucked over in Extreme Super Battle with full rainbow teams. Or like come on, or like what's another example? Like fucking we could use Chain Battle for example too. They could be fuckers like the truth that don't even like make it to number one. Like you know like the you know the, the number number one the the number one highest score. Oh, like on the top, they could be fuckers like him, that they, they like that outdo him and do better than him. Not everyone's like. What I'm trying to say is that even if you're a whale, Dokkan, there's always something new around the corner. That's all I gotta say. There will be always something to do in Dokkan, unless you got every unit in the game link level ten. Every sing, all stages done in the game, all units farmed up, all link level ten. Every rainbow unit in the game. You ain't done with Dokkan, baby. You ain't done. So anyways, any of that. He says it's too easy. He has nothing to do. I'm like, you know, that's fucking bullshit. I'm, I'm thinking in my head. Listen, buddy. I'm, I'm, I I'm, can look at you in the eyes. Because uh, I'm I'm literally like, I'm a fucking prodigy in Dokkan. I look at you in the eyes. I can tell. Okay. If I look at you, I, I can look at you in the eyes and tell if you, you are a, a hardworking Dokkan player. I can look at you and tell. And I can also tell when you use mods. You, you show me your account, motherfucker. It's not hard to spot someone using mods. It, it really isn't. Even in this day and age, especially with those thirty-minute hacks to make it look like you didn't. Like motherfucker, you are not slick. You are not slick. But anyways, you know I'm gonna let's just keep it going. So he's like, you know, it's too easy. You know, I I cleared all Super Battle Road, all that bullshit, and Legendary Goku event. Well, I think it was out at the time, so Legendary Goku event, and all that other stuff. So I'm like, bruh. <laughs> I'm like, bruh. Okay. It's so easy. All I said, I'm like, no, bro, it's not it's not that easy. You have all those events and all those type of other events like Super Battle Road, you know, Legendary Goku. And this is before Extreme Super Battle Road, um, Infinite Dragon Ball History, which is not that hard, but there are some tough stages like the, the Dragon Ball Super Rolling movie stage. I should do like a ranked video on like the, the hardest stages of like each event, but you know, that's for a later day. That's for a later day. Um He says he got all that done, all that good shit, he farmed up everything. I'm like I nigga. That's literally what I say. I'm like, I nigga. And then like Mr. F pitches in to support E and say, Yeah, Dokon's trash. It's too easy. I'm like, I nigga. And then I left. I took I took my ass, my orange juice, and I left. <laughs> I left. <laughs> what I should have did was expose him. I should have looked at that motherfucker's account. I should have I should have been late for class that day and looked at his fucking account. I should look at his account. I could have exposed his ass on the spot, bro. I could have caught his ass slacking, bro. Um, do I have any other stories of uh, people talking about Dokkan being too easy? I mean, th this this video is basically going off of like what people like different people see about Dokkan. Like, you know, my boy Julian, who's never played Dokkan before, sees it as like bejeweled and that nigga uh, E. Thinks it's too fucking easy, which is which is funny. It's because like, with my boy E, let me let me back out here. With my boy E, um, the funny thing is that E needed help building teams. For my boy Javier, my boy Squirtin, my boy Squirtiano Laca Pescador the third, the homie. And if you're watching this video, I fucking love you, my boy. You a goat, bro. You need a help team building. So what makes it think that you? Could beat fucking the super battle road if you need help team building. <laughs> Nigga, look that shit up on YouTube, bum ass. I can't, bro. I can't believe these players, bro. I actually can't believe these players. They really does. They blow minds. But um, I think that's really about it for this video. I I don't have like much to talk about really, other than that, just like that, just e him. Him himself. Hmm. 
Let me think. Do I have another? I don't really have anything else to talk about. I, I, really, I don't. Yeah, I think that's going to be the video. We're just leave off on our boy LR Super Baby Tool. I don't have him full link level 10, but you know, I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. You know what I'm saying? I'm working on it. Come on. I'm working. But um, I appreciate you guys for watching. You guys are the best, bro. I really love y'all. I got over 30 views on my latest video. Yo, y'all are goats, bro. If you make this as far into the video, you know, I know who you are, bro. You know who you are. I know who you are. And I love you. Please just like, like, comment, subscribe. I love you guys. Happy Thanksgiving because, you know, I'm recording this on Thanksgiving. I'm just gonna, I'm uploading this on Black Friday, which is tomorrow, basically, or today. So, um, this is basically past dev. I'll catch you guys in the next video and peace. I love y'all.